His strategic thinking, confident presentation skills shows us the power of clear communication. Trust me, it's not about writing names in a notebook, folks. Today, we're diving into three ways to share ideas with confidence, inspired by Death Note's Light Yagami. Hey, there's in Yoku family. It is Michael Yerby here at MichaelYerby.com, reporting the latest news in anime, hip hop, and personal development. As your friendly neighborhood Air Force Master Sergeant, term personal development expert, and and anime junkie coming to you from the one and only Shreveport, Louisiana. Before we dive in, don't forget to hit the subscribe, like, and share button to dive deeper into the world where personal development meets anime. And drop a comment and let me know where you're tuning in from. Last week, we talked about three reasons why listening is the key to success. Remember, folks, you can't spell listen without silent. All right, that's the joke that might be quiet for some. We'll cover understanding your audience, crafting a clear message, and delivering with confidence. All right, let's transition smoothly into our first topic. I wanna to ask you a question. Why did the confident idea cross the road? To get the brainstorming session on the other side. <laughs> I know these are jokes for tech. Understanding your audience is crucial. Think about Light in Death Note. He knew exactly how to manipulate his audience perception. No, we're not suggesting you become a master manipulator, but knowing what interests your audience helps in tailoring your message effectively. Consider what your audience needs. Like when Light figured out the best way to eliminate threats to his plans, you need to understand your audience problems to offer relevant solutions. Don't worry, your solutions won't be as drastic. Use examples your audience can relate to. Remember how Light used relatable scenarios to explain his thinking. Weaving personal stories and popular culture references like anime can keep your audience hooked. See what I did there? What did we discuss? Know your audience interests, identify their needs, and engage with relatable content. If you got a love affair with anime, sign up on the waitlist for my upcoming book, The Anime Mindset, at michaelyerby.com backslash anime dash mindset dash waitlist to discover how anime's vibrant story can transform your life by fostering resilience, personal growth, and community transformation. Now back to the show. Understanding your audience is just the first step. Next, we need to craft a clear message. Speaking of clear messages. Did you ever hear about the math book that wanted to start his own podcast? It had too many problems to solve. <laughs> Organize your thoughts clearly. Light's plans were always meticulously structured, which made his ideas compelling and convincing. Break your message down into digestible parts to make it easy for your audience to follow. Avoid jargon. Light's explanation were straightforward, enough for everybody to understand. Even if they didn't know his specifics of his powers, using simple language can ensure your message is clear and accessible. Emphasize the main points. Light always knew how to highlight the critical aspects of his plan to get his point across effectively. Make sure your key message stands out to your audience. Crafting a clear message is essential, but it's nothing without confident delivery. Speaking of delivery, why don't we ever see light running late? Because he always had a killer schedule. <laughs> I'm terrible. <laughs> what did we discuss? Structure your ideas clearly, use simple language, and last but not least, highlight key points. That reminds me, join the waitlist for the Peak Society group at michaelyerby.com backslash the Peak Society and be part of an exclusive community of future leaders and visionaries where we dive deep into personal growth, tackle challenges head on and explore the transformative power of anime to optimize performance and lead resiliently in today's high paced world. Confidence comes from practice. Light just don't wing it. He practiced his speeches and presentations. Practice your delivery to build confidence and ensure you convey your message effectively. Your body language speaks volumes. Light's confident demeanor made his ideas seem even more compelling. Stand tall, make eye contact, and use gestures to reinforce your points. 
Be open to feedback. Even Light had to adjust his plans based on new information. Listen to your audience feedback and use it to improve your delivery and message. Delivering with confidence wraps up our main points for the day. Speaking of confidence. Did you know Light never had to worry about public speaking nerves? He had a death note after all. That, that. What did we discuss? Practice your delivery. Use confident body language and handle feedback positively. Transform your journey with free courses like the Five Gravity Rising Above Challenges and Understanding Your Why, designed to elevate your professional and personal growth at michaelyerby.com backslash free. Let's recap our main key points for today's episode. Know your audience interests, identify their needs, and engage with relatable content. Structure your ideas clearly, use simple language, and highlight key points. And last but not least, practice your delivery. Use confident body language, handle feedback positively. As we wrap up, remember that sharing your ideas confidently can transform not only your personal growth, but also your professional journey. Why did the idea go to therapy? because it needed more confidence. <laughs> that was good, nah, whatever. Reflect on a recent time you had to share an idea. How confident did you feel? What steps can you take to boost your confidence next time? What new techniques have you discovered for sharing your ideas confidently? Share your thoughts in the comments below. Explore high quality and unique merchandise in our online storefront to symbolize your journey towards anime. Don't miss out with this chance to grow and support the channel. And remember Zenyoku community, if you love diving into the world of anime with us, exploring personal growth through a unique lens, we need your help. Yes, your help. By clicking on the link in the description, you can support our channel directly. Your support helps create more exciting content and keep the Zenyoku spirit alive. Every click counts and help us continue our journey together. Thank you so much for being part of our journey. Engage with the content further by hitting the subscribe, like, and share button. Thanks for tuning in, Zenyoku family. Until next time, keep understanding your audience, embrace a clear message, and pay it forward with confidence. Peace.